I'm using Bombgar here to remotely support a customer's new MacBook Air running OS X 10.10 Yosemite. Now this customer also has an iPhone and an iPad running the new iOS 8. There's a unique benefit made possible by combining iOS 8 and Yosemite together in that it allows me to use some built-in technology to see the screen of this customer's mobile device during a BombGuard support session. So to do that, I'm going to ask the customer to simply connect their device to their Mac using the USB cable. And once they've done that, I'm going to bring up my list of applications and simply launch QuickTime Player. From the menu in QuickTime, I'll click File, New Movie Recording. Then all I need to do is click the little drop down next to the record button and select the iOS device. In this case, this is my iPhone 5S. Now I'll bring that up. And now I have a live view of this customer's Mac and their mobile device at the same time. So you can instruct the customer to click on Settings and navigate through the various settings, maybe help them configure uh, their email account, uh, whatever the use case may be, but you'll have a live view of that directly from within your BombGuard remote support session. Now I mentioned they had an iPad as well. So if we close this session, this, this QuickTime session, and disconnect the iPhone, and plug in the iPad instead, I heard it connect. Let's just do the process again. We'll do File, New Movie Recording. And then we'll use the selection here to pick the iPad. And we'll be able to see the customer's iPad. So great new benefit of combining Yosemite and iOS 8 with BombGuard Remote Support.